What is up my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King John City 4 and hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video because today I'll be talking about a big, big channel update that will change everything over the next few years. Maybe like one or two years or so, but like everything's gonna be freaking changed here. So if you guys missed out on Friday's live stream, which was Rainbow Six Siege Live number 24, I had a surprise in the video. I showed off my damn new PC. And it was, I was just like pointing at it and all. It was it was still in the box and all because I, I didn't want to turn it around because I had my address on the other side. So I just showed the box and I showed you guys that it was already in my house. And well, I got to install it on Sunday because I'm a work schedule and all that stuff. So I, it wasn't until Sunday where I finally got to test out this beast. It's a big rig too. So um, I tested out the freaking computer, the Cyber Power PC. And uh, it's running super smooth. It runs faster than the old computer. My old computer is literally the stone age over there. It runs super slow. And you know, I did some editing, I did some video editing, some photoshopping and all that stuff. And it just runs super smooth compared to my old computer. I needed this upgrade so bad. Let me show you guys the new computer. There it is. Da 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 da. Cyber Power PC. And by the way, the freaking PC is like backwards. The other side is like some red neon lights it's just that the reason why i have it like that is because my connections are literally on the right side and i cannot change it because my tv is on the right side so so yeah <laughs> you can't see the red neon lights it's a little bit flashy and all but like eh, it's okay i mean it won't wake me up at night but i leave it like uploading some videos and stuff so eh, it's all right that i have it like that <laughs> anyways so yeah, the computer is literally going to revolutionize this whole channel. It's evolving. It's literally my redemption year now because I feel like I can do a lot with this computer. I can play some CSGO. I can play some PUBG. I can play some other games that you guys want me to record off. So I can record off the, the dang computer too. So this is just going to change everything that I do. Hopefully for the good too. So anyways, uh, yeah. So my new computer, it was an amazing you know pick up overall and I want to give thanks to a friend from YouTube of course she recommended me this computer and it's running pretty good so thank you thank you for recommending me this because I was so lost I was about to go into Best Buy and ask for which is the best gaming computer but I was like you know what I know someone who plays with PCs so I asked my fellow YouTube friend and she pretty much recommended me this one and I picked it up and it's going pretty good it's going pretty well so thank you thank you thank you I suggest to do the same thing to whoever wants to buy a new PC. Just ask a YouTube friend or something who's using a gaming PC. Then they'll help you guys better than the workers at Best Buy or, or freaking Staples. Because I got robbed from Staples on my last computer. They told me that was a gaming PC. It couldn't even do that in day one. So I wanted to return it, but I was like, nah, I needed a PC real soon. So anyways, moving on to the next news, um, which is about next week. Or this current week, since this video is going to be uploaded on a Monday. This week, I will not be live streaming, and you guys have been following me for the past few weeks. I've been live streaming every other day. I've been live, I've been live streaming some Fortnite, some Rainbow Six Siege, and I want to say that I want to take a break. I want to take a one week break, and there's like a few reasons behind it. One, I want to use this computer a little bit more. I want to run some more tests on it. And you know, I want to play a little bit more of CSGO and a little bit more of PUBG so I can see how well it runs. And, uh, and the other reason is because I'm getting a little bit tired, a little bit fatigued. I'm going to say fatigue. I'm getting a little bit more fatigued I, like every day that I play like more live streaming and more uh, Rainbow Six Siege. I'm getting so tired that my performance in the game has been going pretty much terrible. Like I haven't been doing good in Rainbow Six Siege at all. And you no know, diabolical Hugh, you notice that I haven't been getting any better, and I kind of want to blame it that I've been so tired because I stay up late live streaming and all that stuff. So I kind of want to take a step back and just like regain my energy so I can be 100% back, especially with this new computer. So this whole week I'm gonna be editing, you know, later on at night instead instead of live streaming. So it's still good because you guys are gonna be receiving new content along the week, a lot, a lot of new edits, a lot of new styles and and stuff like that. Cause I'm gonna like integrate a lot of different styles and down to this channel, jump cuts and all that stuff. I'm gonna see what else I can do too. I want to get into designing also into like designing thumbnails better, into designing like cartoons and all that stuff. Like I want to buy a uh, one of those drawing pads which transfers the, the drawing from. Your pad to the computer like I want to I want to go into more of that and all the, all of that's because of this new computer it allows me to do all that so I'm telling you 
I'm gonna revolutionize. I'm, this is gonna be my redemption year. It's, I'm evolving and all that stuff. So, just with this computer, I'm pretty sure I can pull all that off. So, everything's going for the better now. And uh, hopefully, this is just one big, big ass step to like getting back my partnerships. Since most of you guys already know that I'm already losing my partnership on February 20th, and I want to regain it back as fast as possible because I don't want my my channel to be terminated and stuff. So. Um, so yeah guys that's all the news I wanted to say uh, my next plan oh yeah I forgot my plans for the next two months I'm gonna be picking up Middle Gear Survive I'm gonna be picking up Far Cry 5 and also God of War those are my next three picks for the next three months and yes I will be playing the stories and all those games and I will be showing up here at 6 30 p.m. US Central Time so just like how I've been doing with Call of Duty World War 2 uh, I'm going to be doing the same thing with those games, but a little bit more edited this time, and hopefully you guys enjoy it. So, that's my plan for the next three months. Um, I'm still going to be live streaming, and, and like after next, after this week, I'm going to be live streaming too. I'm going to go back to it and play more Rainbow Six Siege and all that stuff. So, I'll see what else I can do, man. I'll, I'll check out some other sites. I might ask around some other YouTubers, see what else I can, like, maybe, like, collab with someone. I don't know, because this game, this, this PC, sorry, this PC... Can play a little bit of triple A games, so that's good. That's freaking good compared to my old computer, which can not even play CD Skylines or The Forest. It was a shitty computer, I swear. So that is it. Um, I'll be working this whole week on the uh, new intro, of course, since I don't have an intro in this video, and I don't have an outro either. So I'll be looking at sites. I'll be looking at ways to like kind of customize a new intro and all that stuff. So, so yeah, that's all. Those are my plans. That's my big channel update. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. If you guys really support me, leave a like on the video and also subscribe. It's going to be a lot of new content coming up in the future. Oh, and speaking of skipping first person shooters, I actually played Call of Duty World War 2. And well, the evidence is in the background. I'm pretty much whooping ass. I don't know what happened, but I think I'm getting I got better at Call of Duty World War 2 for some reason. Thanks to Rainbow Six Siege, I don't know, but it's been pretty weird that I that I recently got 41 kills with 17 deaths on this map, in the background gameplay. So, if you guys enjoyed that gameplay, leave a like on that too. So I'll see you guys later and subscribe for more.